Hi and welcome to Stamp with Angela. I'm Angela Palmer and today I'm going to share with you about the new style ink pads. So I've got them here in the new five in colours. Um, we've got Call Me Clover, Blueberry Bushel, Pineapple Punch, Lovely Lipstick and Grapefruit Groove. So these ink pads are a little bit different to the other ones so I'll just show you how they work. Move these out the way. So here is some of the old ink pads. So if you have a little look, I don't know if you can tell, but they're a little bit higher and um, the old ones, and these are just a little bit shorter. So if you put them next to each other, you'll see that these are completely flat. These used to have a bit of a, a groove in them, okay? So these new ink pads are designed to stack on top of each other. That's why they've got those four little dots. So you can put it on top of each other like that, and then they stay nicely together. These ones didn't really stack at all. You can kind of see they've got gaps and things. All right, so that's the piece with that. With the old ink pads, you had to kind of push it and flip it. Right, like that. With the new style ink pads, we are just opening it on a hinge. So just open it up like that and then slide it as you did before. To close it, pull it and flip it. Okay, so remember you are just opening it like a hinge. So you'll notice on these ones, I've got a sticker with the name on it there. And on these two, so when they are all stacked up, you can see what they are. And you'll also notice when I open it up that I've got that strip there. Because when you've got a couple of dark colours together, um, if I didn't have that, they look very dark, how do you know which they are? But you can see green and blue quite quickly like that. So I'm going to show you how to get your ink pad ready when you first get it. So here is one that I um, have got to get ready. So on the back it comes with some stickers in a few different languages so we're obviously going to pick the English and then there's a blank one there as well. So the Grapefruit Grove is going to go on the front so look where that is and it's going to go here and the other one is going to go in that part here. So let's see if we can get those off. So I want grapefruit grove. I've got the pressure of you watching me. So that not that end, but where the front of it is. So there. And I'm going to try and nicely put it on the front here in the middle. There we go. We've done well with that. And then we want the bottom one, which is just a plain colour, like this. I should have opened it up first, shouldn't I? And then we're going to put that down there. So you might need tweezers or something to kind of help you a little bit. And put that in. Push it down. Not too bad. There we go. All right, so now that's ready to go. Now you will notice if you leave those, they're a bit bumpy, but if you leave those stickers on, if you try and stack, it still slides because it's just a little bit thick. So when you've finished, you do want to remove all of this, take the sticker off as well, so that, because you don't need the other ones, pull it all off like that. There we go. So then it's not any thicker. So when you do stack them on top of each other, I'd better put the right way around, I guess. Um, then it's not going to slide. All right, and then you can see the names of them, and they're all on top of each other. All right, so any if you get any of the new style ink pad, remember they're stackable. Remember to put your sticker on the front and put your sticker on the inside, and then remove any extra on the back, and you're ready to go. Thanks for watching.